Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Malt. So happy to be here with you guys. As always, I just got done eating some sushi with my wife and a couple of our friends. It was really good. Do you guys like sushi? Let me know below. Um, random beginning, but it was just on my mind because we just got back. But we have another episode of Let's Clash today. Uh, there's really not that much that can go on um, on this account anymore. Let's go ahead and, uh, I'm sorry, let's go ahead and request some troops. Not getting on a plane anymore. <laughs> um, protect me. Uh, I don't really care what I get. Um, but, so this is another episode of Let's Clash. We're going to have a raid in this video. Uh, and hopefully, <clears throat> I know I do have, oh, dang it. So something that I'm doing as I am upgrading my uh, walls is upgrading like my mines. I'm about to get them all to max uh, because really I don't have anything else to do. So I'm upgrading this one, this one, this one, and then I'm going to have one, two, and three gold mines left until max. And then all of my elixir collectors are currently at um, level 10, so I am going to have to spend some gold to get those up. They are only 168,000, but still I'm trying to get my walls up to max, so whatever. Um, here we go, now I can get rid of this. But in this video, hopefully we can have a solid raid uh, that will get us, uh, we only need 43,000 more to be able to, oh hey thanks, level 6 archers, TY bud. Um, but hopefully in this video, uh, we will be able to get enough to uh, upgrade our elixir, our elixir, come on molt, our rage spell up to level 4, um, and then really all that we will have left to do, um, besides like our king, um, so I can't upgrade that anymore. Uh, we have our king to upgrade. I don't think, I mean, I can upgrade my bombs. I don't necessarily want to do that right now at this point because they're so expensive. I'm not really too, I'm not too worried about that. Um, I definitely will do it eventually, but it's so freaking expensive and I don't want to deal with that right now. Um, but why don't we go ahead and go on the attack and break our shield. And I'm going to talk to you guys about a little bit as we look um, for what we need. Wow. So since I don't care about trope, why would you go after that? There we go. Is it safe? Oh yeah. Um, so since I don't care about trophies, I'm just gonna uh, get 400, wow, almost 500 elixir per shot on that thing um, while I talk to you guys about something. So I'm trying to think of some new series um, to for the channel. Um, Something that I haven't seen on YouTube for a long time is more of an informative uh, type series where it goes into like the statistics of things and why they work like they do. So for instance, like the wizard tower, say you were to get um, like a level 7 wizard tower or something like that. Um, wizard towers shoot every 1.3 seconds um, and the damage of defenses is measured by seconds so it's like 40 damage per second for a level 7 um, <clears throat> times or whatever the math would be 1.3 equals 52 damage um, every shot so every time the wizard shoots it deals that much damage um, so I was wondering if you guys would want me I know that this raid is still going on I'm gonna go ahead and um, I guess I could know if I go after that I don't want to deploy too much. I'm just going to get all that for free with two archers. Two archers, 53,000 elixir. Nice. I didn't want to deploy any more to go after those other ones, so whatever. Um, but what I want to hear from you guys is if you would like me to go into a series like that. So it would be like Define Defenses or something. Um, would be the name of the series. Something... Something along those lines where I explain to you, okay, so this is how much a wizard tower at this level costs. Um, this is how much damage a second it does. This is how much damage per shot it does. This is how long it will take to kill um, a group of goblins uh, that are level whatever. Man, look at this. Woo! I do, I do, I do like this. Let's get rid of this Barbarian King. Um, gosh, I'm pretty sure all of this is on the outside. 
I'm not even going to worry about that wizard tower right there. I'm just going to, well, or that archer tower. Um, so as I do this and as I deploy whatnot, um, I'm just going to keep on talking. I'm not going to look at y'all, obviously, since I'm, since I'm raiding. This is very, very straightforward. I'm just literally going after these collectors. Um, but I want to know from y'all if you would like a series like that where I kind of go into more details of that kind of stuff. So that way when you go to a base and you say, okay, um, I have level five, I have level five archers. Um, this base has level six wizard tower, which means that it's going to do 41.6 damage per second. Um, do I want to attack this base with these archers or not? Um, so I can go into that kind of information if you guys want. If not, it's fine. Like we can, I can literally have a whole series on one where I talk about just splash defenses. So I'll talk to you guys about mortars, or I'll talk to you guys. Um, I'm not going to raid any more on this one just because of, um, just because it's not necessary. Look at that. Oh gosh, that's an awesome raid. <laughs> that's such an awesome find for the amount of troops that I had to use. Sweet. Let's go ahead and, and research this bad boy right here. Research. Um, nice. So that's going to be done in five days. And I still have a pretty good amount of stuff left. Um, so let me know what you guys think because I can do a series on just splash defenses. I can do something on um, air defenses, so I can talk about bombs, I can talk about um, air defenses, <laughs> I can talk about uh, archer towers since they shoot after air, I can talk about teslas since they do, and then I can talk about cannons and bombs, blah blah blah, all that kind of stuff. So it be more of the science behind it and kind of give you guys a little bit more knowledge as to um, what it might take for you to defeat a base. Um, what do we have? Five of these? Yeah. So let me know in the comments down below if you guys would like that. I think it could be fun. I definitely think that I would enjoy it because, shoot, I would be able to learn a lot. Because uh, in my last video, I got a bunch of flack for being an idiot and saying that um, I totally forgot to calculate that uh, extra 0.3 seconds on the wizard tower. Um, and some people were uh, saying that I was a noob for that. So whatever everybody has their mistakes but let me know if you guys would like that because it would take some research on my part um, to have the facts ready for you guys and to go over but I would definitely enjoy that I think it could be fun uh, majority rules so in the comments down below if you would like to learn more about the defenses about the troops about all that kind of stuff instead of just being like yeah, I'm pretty sure my archers can destroy that archer tower, whatever it may be. Um, and we can also go into the math of, okay, so this archer tower shoots every 1.5 seconds. It causes this much damage. How many archers will it take for me to deploy to destroy that archer tower effectively? Uh, because, you know, once you get into the higher levels, there is going to be a lot of strategy to this that... You do need. I keep looking at the camera and totally forgetting about my phone. So, for those of you who aren't, just look down in the, in the corner at me while I talk to you guys. Um, but as you can see in this episode, we just upgraded that uh, rage spell, and I'm gonna upgrade a couple walls as well. But as I've said probably 36 times already in this episode, comment down below if you guys want me to do a series like that. Um, leave a like if you want me to, etc., etc. Um, and yeah, that's going to be pretty much it. I'm going to upgrade a couple of walls right here. And yeah, that's going to be it. Guys, thank you so much for watching. If you are new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe. Promise you that I won't let you down. You can ask all my other subs. Uh, I try and keep things interesting and fun for y'all. And that is about it. You guys rock. I really do mean that. Thank you so much for the support. We're probably going to... Let me check on this. Uh, we're probably going to hit... Yeah, we're definitely going to hit 32,000 by morning. So, thank you. I mean, really, that's all that I can say is thank you for that. Um, but that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching and supporting me, Molt. It's, it's a dream come true, it really is. Uh, but hey, as always, guys, why don't you make sure that you keep calm and clash on for me, all right? I'll see you guys later.